Prime alert tonight to tell you about after a scary situation in South Charlotte, a family says their two year old was kidnapped when someone stole their car from a gas station parking lot. We're told the child was left in the running car while her mom went into quick trip and someone jumped in the driver's seat and took off. The suspect ended up ditching it shortly after and is still on the run tonight. The child is doing OK. NBC Charlotte's Tanya Midness following the story tonight. Tanya, scary reminder that you shouldn't leave your kids in the car under any circumstances. Well, just about every parent has thought about it. I got to run into the store. I've got my kid in the car seat in the back. Should I leave the keys inside and leave the car running? I'll just be gone a second, right? Maybe not. A 24 year old mom pulled up to this QT on South Boulevard with her two year old daughter in the back seat. Said, I got to run in, use the money machine inside real quick. So she left her daughter in the car, thought she'd be gone just a moment. Even though you think you're inside for 20 or 30 seconds, you know, in reality, you're in there for possibly five or six or seven minutes. When she came back out, the car was gone and so was her daughter. Certainly we wanted to find the car, but but even more paramount was to find was to find the child. Car theft, a crime that happens time and time again in Charlotte. Last year, 840 cars were stolen with the keys inside. And this, not the first time a child was in the car. Someone just stole my car from the gas station and my child is in there. And you hear about it on the news, but you never think that it's going to happen to you. Fortunately, this time, the mother called a family member who went out looking for the car. She called him, and he responded uh, and actually saw the car and followed it for a short distance. He told police two thieves hopped out, ran away, leaving the toddler safe and unharmed. Police still searching for the suspects, but not letting mom off the hook. They cited her with misdemeanor child neglect. Leaving your child in a car while you go into a store at 11:30 at night um, is not the most responsible thing that a that a parent can do. I spoke to the grandmother of the child in this case, who tells me they're all very grateful that the little girl is okay and unharmed. They said though they didn't want to speak on camera because now they have to deal with the legal issues surrounding the mother. I'm Tanya Mendes, NBC Charlotte.